Hi Aisha, how are you? Hello, I'm good. How are you? I'm fine. You are yeah. my senior. Yeah. So tell me about CBIT. Yeah, Aish. Like how CBIT. is the college? Yeah, like you yeah. are the recently graduated. Yeah, yeah. So CBIT is like one of the top state colleges for MSET, of course. So most of the people usually take admission either through MSET or like through JE mains. So that would be like the way to enter CBIT, or you can also offer the NRI quota. which is uh, you get admissions through the third well for the the nri quotas really i accept the igcsc board right yeah that's about it like about the admission process and what else would you like to know more about cbit in specific like uh, how did you got into it how i got into cbit is like um, basically like i told you right there will be cutoffs for every uh, particular thing so in mset like for computer science you have a cutoff of i think 1500 rank and there are different cutoffs according to like the different um, uh, different castes and like different categories that people come from so uh, according to that you get the admission through that and you also have the full scholarship that is given by the government if you fall under the economically weaker category so you don't have to pay any of your fees the government will be paying the entire fees you just have to pay for the ncm exams which is a very uh, less amount it, it's like 2500 rupees so the government will be paying your entire fee so in that case also you are very good in that manner so i think a lot of colleges that you particularly get through mset the government can pay your fee if you have a really good rank so i think that is a good thing about most of these colleges and i particularly got in through mset so every year the rank cut off changes according to the different parameters that change every year so aap north se hai na right ha ha main north se north mein kahan pe odisha se oh odisha to so, meko ye yeah, yes. i wanted to know this about like how did you came to know about this mset Okay, okay. So, like, I am from Odisha, but I've been staying in Hyderabad for the past ten years. Oh. So, like, my parents work here. Both my parents work here. So, the things I know is that my school also I have been here. My schooling also I have been here. I am fifth standard from uh, Hyderabad. I was studying. Before that, I was studying in Australia. So, like, still, like. From a long time, I've been staying in Hyderabad, and this house is also our own. So I have a very good idea. I'm like a localite at this point. Okay. So where have you pursued your schooling? Yeah, into college. Yeah. So I have done schooling in Kenya. It's in Bajupalli, near Kenya. It's a global school. So I have done schooling from tenth class to there. After that, I have done schooling in Fiji, which is in Miyapur, in Miyapur. Fiji. वो पीजी कोचिंग लिया था मैंने 11th और 12th के लिए उसके बाद तो मैंने सीबीआईटी ज्वाइन किया था तो आपको जेई मेंस और आईआईटी में नहीं आया कुछ भी उतना अच्छा रैंक नहीं आया था नहीं लाइक like, वहां पे वो कंप्यूटर साइंस ब्रांच तो मिल ही नहीं रहा था सो आई वांटेड लाइक दैट ब्रांच इन स्पेसिफिक बाकी सारे ब्रांचेस के लिए आई वाज नॉट इंटरेस्टेड सो हाउ वाज योर लाइक हाउ मच वाज योर फीस कॉलेज फीस लाइक सीबीआईटी फीस CBIT fees. So the year I joined, those sir fees actually बढ़ गया था. मेरे पहले seniors के लिए ना मेरे seniors के लिए fees था around 1.2 lakhs. But the year I joined, वो fees बढ़ गया था around 1.6 lakhs. Okay. And for anyone who will join this year, the fees is around 2 lakhs. Just the fees per year. And after that, you have to also pay for transport. And for boys, you can opt for the hostel as well. and apart from this also you have some fees that comes under the exam fees like the semester exam fees and the miscellaneous fees that is for like the college purposes like some paper filing and multiple like they just take it like that do you think it, it is worth it to pay 2 lakhs annually yeah i think it's worth it like see if you're getting one of the top branches and your target is placements i think paying 2 lakhs is worth it especially if you are a localite of hyderabad it's definitely worth it and you got it through a rank like if you can even like offer the nri quota but that seat is very costly let me tell you that the nri quota seats will cost you around 6000 dollars per year that is around 5 to 6 lakhs an year so people also spend 5 to 6 lakhs Per year, just for the same CBIT seat, and a lot of people uh, like who are not able to afford this fees. I told you that the government pays the entire fees for them, so you can apply for that. Many people in my class, around like thirty to forty uh, people in my class, like in my branch, applied for this government uh, scholarship, and they got the 
entire scholarship for free so they didn't have to pay the school lakh per year fees or is it so i want to tell you this that uh, i belong to uh, bce category we, uh, yeah. we come under minorities all muslims yeah. so we don't have to pay the fees yeah. for minorities and that same goes to the scst caste also yeah 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 hmm. so that's the, good right that's yeah. a plus point for you to look at cgd from that i to pay the full fees but yeah like for anyone else also i can recommend ki they can opt for the scholarship if they don't have the budget or they have they don't have the economic uh, like circumstances to pay for it like the the students right now i don't recommend to pay that much yeah what so do you think about it i might not find it uh, yeah like instead of you if you really feel that the fees is very high you can maybe opt for a government college instead of cbit you can go for rosmania or jntu where the fees is very nominal it's 10000 rupees per year so i think any man can afford 10000 rupees per year like for two semesters so they can opt for jntu or rosmania if they feel that is the case but for any private college especially in the state level you should be like ready to spend some money like even if you go to vnr vasavi and all the other colleges are also increasing their fees to 2 lakhs per year so that's something i think it's the same in all the top other private colleges as well.